Hello Summoners and Summonettes, Gordon here, and today I am pretty dang tired because I literally just rolled out of bed and decided I need to record some videos because I'm pretty- they don't have a smite. <laughs> what the fuck? Sorry. I just got sidetracked. Uh, okay. Well, we'll talk about that later. But uh, I'm going to be pretty much gone the entire weekend because if you haven't figured out already on social media, I'm actually going to be one of four casters, but one of two primary casters for Indie PopCon, which is this weekend, and it's probably one of the biggest, if not the biggest, tournament for League of Legends that the Midwest has had, so pretty stoked for that, and it's already uh, in works with Twitch that it's going to be on front page Twitch and stuff like that, so huge exposure, hopefully it'll be very high production value, I'm going to actually do a dry run today so it would have been yesterday for when I released this video I believe or two days whatever but uh so I'm pretty much gonna have all my time locked down so I decided you know what I need to get a video out this weekend for you guys so I'm not pretty much Mia for you know four days because this event is going to take a lot out of me so let's go ahead and get into the game here we are Twisted Fate up against Victor in the mid lane not the best matchup for us he has pretty you know, one-on-one -on -one capabilities to fight me here with his shielding, and he's got a decent range with his laser as well, so I'd give the matchup actually to Victor here, but we're not really, we don't play Twisted Fate to win out lane, we play Twisted Fate to win other lanes, you know? So, gonna go ahead and lock in the red card, we'll just uh, try and keep the wave match where his wave is at, but yeah, their jungler doesn't have a smite, I just realized that they have no smite. So, I don't know, they have three teleports, but at the same time, they also have an incredibly scary team comp for you. Also, you got Alistair, Callista, Victor, and Zach. Everybody can knock up. That's like, I need to get this Yasuo a week, dude. Because if this guy gets rolling, we are in some booty. Alright, missing some CS because we're bad here, but I mean, everybody knows that. Oh, got that one still, though. Alright, let's get that one, and... Oh, see, that's what I mean. Victor's busted. Oh, but I trade my key back to him, okay. But yeah, it's actually going to be really hard for me to do anything one-on-one -on -one against this guy. It's definitely going to need... It is very viable for Evelyn to flank this guy, though, so we'll see if that actually happens or not. Getting that siege minion, missing the other minion, because we're bad. Alright, what's Evelyn doing? What are you looking like you're doing? What is wrong with my CS? Okay. We're still quasi-tied with this guy. Oh my god, I misclicked. Holy shit. I'm like, oh, it's too early for this shit. It's too early. Yep, I'm just blaming it. I missed like the entire wave, dude. I fucking suck at this game. Okay, okay. We're chilling. So I wonder. Dude, there's Zach has to be having the worst time in the jungle. You, it's so hard to clear without Smite, because you can't buy jungle items that allow you to clear easily. The guy's just gotta be on a huge jungle bus, man. No doubt about it. Alright, so the nice thing about Twisted Fate, nice, already shutting down the Yasuo with the Darius up top, is Twisted Fate's pretty much annoying as hell because he has an infinite mana pool with his W. Just always throwing gold, or not gold cards, blue cards at him, and uh, wow, that trade. That was pretty bad. I should never walk up at all to trade with this guy if I'm not throwing a card at him. Otherwise, I just straight up lose the trade. He'll use his Q and laser and just fuck me. Is what is currently happening. Alright. Alright, let's go ahead and pull out a blue card, try and secure the siege minion here. And if you're bad at last sitting, you have amplified auto attacks with your cards. Always a bonus. Okay, I'm getting pooped on, dude. I just need level 6 so I can get out of this lane. Yeah, we have. What? Why do we have both 6 in the game? Our 6 is so bad. Alright, screw it. I'm gonna stick around, use a potion. Has he even oh we forced one potion out of him. Let's go, baby. Or one biscuit, I should say. Okay, he's stepping up. Jungler might be nearby, and he's pushing, so I don't really have any reason to play that far forward. I can just last it with my Q and we'll be fine. Rummy, get the fuck out of this basement right now. Hopefully he just uh finds a blanket and chills. Otherwise I'm gonna have to move him. And I'm gonna be so tilted if I have to move you again, Rummy. You're not allowed down here yet, you always come down here. 
All right. Let's try and get out of this lane here. I want to try and hit six soon. No, he's coming up here. Get off my desk. Pick a car. Okay, okay, okay. We might have to go back real quick. I don't want to, though. No. I need something to distract him. Bottle cap. Okay, he's distracted, kind of. Just throw anything within arm's reach and he'll go chase it. But that only lasts, like, <laughs> half a second. Oh, god dang it. Okay, okay, okay. Focus up. We're not gonna have this happen two episodes in one week, man. I just can't. Wow, that siege went in. Should have had that. That was dumb of me. Where is their Zack? I'm actually terrified. Okay, he's going into a bag. That's okay. Might be loud, but he's not going into our shit. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and go back though, and we'll pick up a Sheen, some potions, and some boots. Pretty much all you could want on your first back on Twisted Fate. I'm just gonna go for that Lich Bane, and then, depending on how the game's going, we'll pick up anything else. I mean, Twisted Fate has such a huge... Uh, variants and builds that he can go, so. Yeah, out of the bag? Okay, he's out of the bag. But yeah, you can play 10 games of Twisted Fate in a row and have a different build every single game, so. He's pretty versatile as far as uh, build paths go. But, Lich Bane, pretty core cool item. You're gonna want that in almost every build on Twisted Fate here. Alright, let's just get this shove and see if we can alt anywhere. I don't think so, though. Zach, oh my god, look at that build. He's so far behind. You don't get any bonus XP. Your clear is just awful. I feel so bad. I've done that before, and I just want to AFK when I don't have Smite and I'm in the jungle. I don't know if he did that on purpose, though. There's no way he did that on purpose. That's, there's nothing meta about not having Smite. Alright, let's get that Siege Minion. Let's go. I need to ping me on Victor here. So one risky thing about me alting actually is they have three teleports, so they could potentially all be on my face at any moment in time. I'm gonna go ahead and port in here, we'll see if we can lock down the Zac. Oh, he flashes out. Ooh, I still hit him though, because I'm a god. But we're just getting in range to uh, throw a gold card at this guy, hopefully. His wind wall's down, so he should die here more than likely. Dude, what is this? They keep flashing, and I keep hitting them still. With my uh, try card though, I should be fine. Yeah, we're out. He could try and flash kill me with this combo, but I should- Okay, I'll flash. It actually did a little bit more damage than I thought it would, but, uh... Oh! Oh! I almost killed myself. What is wrong with me? Why did I run back in- Oh my god, okay, okay. We'll stay for the Zack, though, because Eve's coming, and I can pick off the Zack with a, uh... Pew! Alright, we got in. We killed one of his blobs. Oh, they TP'd to save his blob! That Yasuo outplay- Oh, shit, am I dead? Oh! Okay, we're good, we're good. Sona did die, though. Uh, Darius? Did you have some not all? I thought- okay, okay, okay. Okay. Evelyn might go for it. Oh, she went too late. But she, she's gonna live. Okay, we're chilling. we're chilling. Everybody's chilling. We're good. I forgot I have teleport, so I could teleport as well. And I could just teleport back to lane, which I might do. Now we'll be able to make it back to a certain time. But, uh, that's another nice thing about Twisted Fate. I- I never bring Ignite as Twisted Fate, even though I never played Twisted Fate. You should always bring TP, just because... What the fuck? She didn't even get the Siege Radiator, then she just pushed the wh What the fuck? Okay. But, uh... That's the nice thing about Twisted Fate, is if you bring Teleport, you can go make a play on the map and then instantly be right back on... You know, in your lane. chilling. Or, you could make a play top and then Teleport bot, and you just affected pretty much every lane besides your own, so... Lots of versatility with, uh, bringing Teleport on Twisted Fate. Dude, that was like, that wasn't even a tax. I would understand if you like held the wave, just kind of thinned it out a little. That was just like, rude. What was that, Eve? I'm actually so sad. Alright, what's the cat doing? He's being a butthead. Around me. I need something to throw, but I cleaned off my desk. I don't have anything left. I still have so many things to throw. Now all I have is League of Legends. Alright. Nice, should be able to get that, and I should have had a card drawn, could have got that one, but oh well. Still must CS in the game somehow, even though I think we're CSing like a Baronzi. Alright, laser down, so we can walk up. We'll just throw a red card, nice, it hits him as well. 
And the Q hit him as well. Actually, that's a decent amount of poke damage down under this guy. Alright, we'll snag that. Okay, cool. Easy wave clear, baby. Yeah, so it's top. I don't know where Zach is, but he's still... I mean, he might be level... Okay, stop. I'm coming to counter gank this. Hopefully, I want him to jump in, actually. And I know Victor doesn't have a teleport to follow me, but I think we were uh, pinged off by the enemy team. Probably Victor pinging that I uh, left lane, which clearly I did. I wanted to teleport. Alright. Just trying to always keep the wave moderately on his side, just so I can teleport and not really get punished for it. But, uh... Kind of hard to do it on Victor. He just presses in the majority, if not all, the wave is gone. Nice. E down. Okay. Don't have to worry about a laser beam on my face for this wave. Excuse me. Nice. Good job, Hotline. Alright. And we'll just gather up those minions. Okay. Uh, Alistair is left. I'm not going to port for just the Alistair. Not worth it. I mean, I guess I could stay mid lane if all my other lanes are winning. I can just push this victor in and it kind of keeps him in the mid lane as well. But that's boring. I want to be part of the kills, man, you know? Oh god! Okay, we got it with an odd attack. I was going to be so salty if we missed that siege booty, man. I guess I'm just going to go back. What the hell? Okay, so... Zach's bot side because they just gave victor blue, so we'll just ping that out. We'll buy a pink board because we're a player. We're a team player. Dude, I have used my teleport once this game. Okay, okay. I need to use my TP. I need to alt somewhere and get a kill and then TP back mid lane. Or we should just force fire dragon. What the hell? They don't have a smite to contest. This would be like the freest dragon for us to take. Okay, since they're... Yasuo is pretty shut down and he's like... A core component of their potential wombo combo. I think what I'm gonna do... I can't get that one is since Victor is quasi a threat, I might go Abyssal Scepter, and they do have a Zac on their team as well. But maybe not. Maybe I'll just go for more damage, actually. That could be a plan. I could go Morello and just go CDR Twisted Fate as well. That'd be decent. So if I ever want to gank bot lane, I pretty much have to go on close no matter what. Even, I mean, you wouldn't normally go on an Alice or anyway, but if it was any other support, I'd still go on close because if you go on the support, Clissa just presses R and you've wasted your ultimate and a lot of time and oh god, we're okay, we're okay. I have to flash. Hopefully he doesn't have jump. Oh! I'm too good! I'm too good! Okay, I'm running all the way up there and I'll probably have to either ultimate back mid lane or uh, teleport. And that's, okay, there he is. Yeah, I'm gonna actually use my TP back, and I guess we'll just buy a Amp Tome for now. But uh, I wanna use my TP just because it's a longer cooldown, get that rolling, and the ultimate is a quicker teleportation, you know, right on top of their face. I don't need a minion or a ward to TP do, so it's a guaranteed uh, port for me. So it just allows for a lot more easier uh, access to the enemy's faces here. Let's go ahead and just keep this wave evened out here. I'm gonna miss that one, but whatever. I'm bad. Alright, let's go ahead and help out with this flamer. Go ahead and just draw blue cards. And blue. Okay. So I should get this. Be a nice little bit of damage for us here. I'm just gonna lock in whatever card to help do damage to that. There we go. Next dragon's in the Earth Drake. Could allow us for a 20 minute Baron, but I don't think we want to try and do a Baron against that enemy team comp. That is just a throw waiting to happen. Are they fighting? Did they need me? Okay, we got one. I could port down to secure two. And I'm going to, actually. And it's Q's on cooldown. We'll let everyone get in on the money real quick. And there she goes. Double kill for Ezreal. Nice. Uh, I mean, probably not too worth me using my ult for just that, but whatever. I was... This game was stale for me, man. I, I need to be, get some action going. Alright, do have rank 2 of our ultimate, which is good. I'm just gonna try and get this shift up. Evelyn's looking like she's gonna hold mid for me, hopefully. Uh, just go kill the wave, you're wasting a hell of time. Just go kill the wave. Okay. Oh, she's going for it. You need to get out, you need to get out. Oh, god, she got stunned. I think... Did she flash? Yeah, okay. 
It's a good flash. She would have died otherwise, 100%. I think I'm faster than this guy. Hopefully I am. Got the gold card off. Got his flash. Might hit him with the Q still. Nope. We missing. But one more auto attack might do it. Any card gets him. Okay. All I needed was the... I knew I had Thunderlords coming. So I could lock any card in and it would have killed him there. So we're just going for the Thunderlords deeps right there. And secured it. I'm going to miss that minion, but whatever. Alright, Yasuo is on the top side of mid right now, so I'm going to be quasi-careful while attempting to shove this in and deny a wave. Alright, I need to go with City Boots as well. Let's get some CDR rolling on us. Alright, that was probably... who? That was a Zack Ward, I guess? I don't know. Alright. Yeah, we'll go with these boots, actually. And we'll turn this into a Mar... I think we'll go Morello. Yeah, I kind of like Morello. This gives us so much CDR. Do I need Morello though? Do I need Morello though? What else could I turn this into? Zonias? We might want Zonias as well. That could get rid of their kind of wombo combo. Or just go kill him before he kills that. Take the ground from him. There you go. And kill him. Easy money, dude. Would have done the same play as Evelyn. Or if I was Evelyn. Alright, their sack is level 6, man. Oh, not having smite is just so painful. <laughs> So painful. Alright. Do you think before doing this? Oh my! Shots fired! Holy everybody deck! Brutal! That was savage! Alright. Key misses. Zach's off to the bottom side of the lane here potentially. Oh, give me that. Get out of traded. I should have thrown in the auto attack for uh, Thunderbirds prior there and it would have been really good, but still out traded him. Ow! Ow! And then I get out traded there. Yo, stop doing the race. Help me defend my pink. Okay. Rest of peace, pink. Darius wants the race instead of saving my pink. Oh. That should be a kill on Callista, maybe? Oh god, and the exhaust. This guy might not get a kill. Holy moly. Well played, enemy team. Wow, this game's actually kind of close when it doesn't need to be close at all. Alright, I, I can port in with that one here. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, lock in my card. We're coming in hot. Gonna go ahead and just pop the cluster right away and then hopefully kill the rest here. Alistair doesn't have much mana, if at all any. And we'll lock down the Zac as well, get him killed, and there's the Bloblets. And this is going to be money in the bank for us here. Give me that kill. What? She smited the chaos of you, bitch. Alright, easy, easy money though. That's just uh, straight greed by the enemy team staying there. They had no resources left and they had to have known Twisted Fate and Evelyn are going to be looming so I will take that any day of the week baby let's go ahead and push this up <clears throat> Ugh, excuse me. and we will try and get this turret here just getting rid of the minion wave first and we'll throw some blue cards in sieging potential with Twisted Fate pretty nice here using that lich fan to uh, whittle down the turret let's go ahead and get another wave because we're mean. And we want to just deny everything from Israel. Who is that? That's Yasuo or Zach? Okay, it's Yasuo. Oh! That gold card around the wall is actually beautiful. But no follow up. But that's all good. Oh shit, he almost died. Does Israel have ult? Israel does have ult. Can he snipe him? Let's just go for the Alistair for now. I don't think he's going to have his ult up in time actually. So I might be able to pick up a kill on the Alistair here. Let's go ahead and sip on a biscuit. Get some mana for another card, and another double kill for Ezreal. Beautiful. I don't know why the enemy team is just chasing into us when they don't have... I'm, I was like 80% sure that Alistair did not have ult up again, so I don't know. Crazy stuff by the enemy team. But uh, we will just pick up the Zonius, and I think we're going to go death cap next item, because I want some fat damages on me now. I'm really not afraid of anyone on their team. Callista, she's got all their kills, but it's a Callista. If she's auto-attacking me, that means I'm in range to keep... Q and W her, so not too afraid of that. Wow, that chunk. Alright, Victor. Your little ease on cooldown, buddy. But it doesn't matter, because you have range over me. Alright, let's see. Dare or Yasuo is probably gonna die eventually here. I don't know what that Q was. He just accepts his fate. I'm not even gonna bother walking over there. Because he is done, so. Let's just, uh. What? Did he actually juke them? Okay, some trading going over from Victor and I. Why is he still alive, top? What the fuck? 
Oh my god, do I have to... Okay, okay, I'm not gonna pour it. That's just embarrassing. Okay, they got him. Let's say, how the hell did that guy live? I might be able to flash combo this guy. If I hit him with one more Q, I think I can kill him. Oh my god, I just got chunked though. Walked onto his, uh... His thingamajigger. How low is Zach? I didn't... If I saw Zach's health bar, if he was low too, I might suicide yellow port into that. Not sure why he would walk up and try and trade like that to me. But that W's busted. Okay. I was thinking I could kill him, actually, but that W's done. I should have flashed out of his W and I would have killed him, actually. Because then he wouldn't have had the uh, time to line up his ultimate. God dang, I had Zonus. Oh my god. If I just Zonus, I knew he was going to all. If I had Zonus, his initial burst, he probably would have walked away, but I also would have kept my flash, so. Damn. That's actually. I always forget I have Zonus when I buy, dude. I'm actually salty that happened. Nice kill there, though. <clears throat> so they did pick up the Earth Drake, but I don't think it's gonna matter. I don't see them doing Baron without Smite. I guess they have it closer to potentially secure it, but that's still really risky. Alright, gonna go ahead and pour it in. Oh! Wait, why did you leave your team? Okay, well, we got a free chunk on the Clissa, and Evelyn should be able to. Okay, or, or Ezra, one of the two is gonna pick up the kills. Alistair's dead, I'm just gonna hit this ward. Not gonna waste my time chasing that. 2 0 oh, 7. I mean, it's not a bad score on Twisted Fate. It means I'm, you know, participating across the map, which I have been. I'd like a little bit more kills, but, uh, not gonna complain with 7 assists on Twisted Fate. It means you're doing your job. I say I'm not gonna complain a lot, huh? I guess I just never complain. Can't complain about that if you know what I mean. Alright, let's go ahead and get this mid turret. This is the last outer turret I left. Okay, that was easy. <laughs> I didn't realize how low that thing was. That was easier than I thought it was gonna be. So I do have my telepathy up, but I don't have flash, so I still gotta be really respectful. Let me get mana back. Ugh! You bitch. I should be able to get it on the minion wave still. Okay, good. Wow. Racist turret. Uh, not sure if DC. Okay, no. He's just taking hella damage. Victor's coming down here. Yeah, there he is. I should be able to lock him down here and probably just kill him. Why would you walk up to- I don't understand! I'm gonna throw the golden card at you, man. Okay, well that's another kill. Oh, Darius died. Who did he die to? I didn't mean to draw a gold card there or rip my mana. Oh, well, I'm gonna go back anyways. We'll buy a NL rod, component of death cap. Alright, we do have our all off cooldown already. Pretty short cooldown because we do have 35% CDR. I should go for 45%. I do have the uh, mastery that lets me have 45%. What's the CDR item would I want to buy? I could buy a Abyssal Scepter, that'd give me another 10%. And a little bit of MR for the Victor, who still does quite a bit of damage, even though he's 0-3. We'll see. But for now, I'm definitely going to go Death Cap. But 19-8 to 8 is the overall score for this game. Excuse me. We are 2-0-8. Doing pretty well. Alright, let's just go ahead and try and lock down the Zack. Do get him, get his flash as well. He's gonna have his jump, but we get the Blobulate in time. And this motherfucker is gonna chaos again with Smite. You. Okay, I could've actually killed, because she smited before we killed the uh, last Blob, but whatever. That guy's tanky, what the hell? Why are you so tanky? Alright, let's just keep this wave pushed, though. Push, 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 push. Alright, we'll get that as well. Beautiful. Oh, party down bot lane. Are we okay? We're chilling? Okay. Let's go ahead and pick off this Victor here, because he's bad. I don't think he has flash. Oh, okay. Well, he flashed straight. Got him with the auto attack. Good. Got that kill there. Oh, baby. You trying to bump uglies? I'm not trying to bump uglies. I have no mana. <laughs> I'll just chunk you, though. Wait, what? Why did you run? What is the pathing of the enemy team? They just ran straight to- Okay, okay, okay. We're getting trolled. This isn't actually a game. Oh, they surrendered. Okay. Ah, uh, teleport. I need to use my teleport more. Woo! -hoo. We did it. 3-0 oh, and 10. Not too bad. Oh, we actually got a last hit. Nice. Uh, I'm curious to see what our damage was, though. I mean, I feel like we did a decent amount of damage, but there was just so much action in top and bot lane. They might have easily out-damaged me there. Nice. Got the S. Okay, I'll, 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 I'm okay with that damage. I'm okay with that. Most gold in the game, though, but 
it's pretty easy to get a lot of gold on Twist of Fate. You have your passive giving you gold, and you have the ability to play make across the map. So, easy stuff there, but I will take it. If you like the video, go ahead and throw a like. I'll have all my other social media, such as Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook, as well as Room Smashers in the info box down below. And as always, guys, I'll see you all next time.